How's it going everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to send a test email in Brevo. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do this is quite simple. And the first thing that we need to do on Brevo is we want to make sure that we're logged in to our account as an administrator, and this should take you to the dashboard, which is what you're uh, seeing right now. So because we're looking for uh, the option to send a test email, so basically getting a newsletter or an ad campaign from point A to point B and us controlling both recipients, or rather I should say um, the recipient as well as the sender, um, you guys wanna click on the, or rather you wanna navigate to the left-hand side of the screen. You'll see the option that says campaigns. So it's this one right here. So what you guys need to do is click on this campaigns and right away, um, you'll see that there's an option in the top right corner that says to create a campaign. So you obviously want to cl click on this and you'll be met with a bunch of different options. So because we're looking to send a test email, we'll select uh, the standard email for the one-off campaign from scratch. So we're going to click on this, just like that. And you'll have two options here being regular and A-B test. So A-B test is what we're looking to do. However, I should say that um, to actually get access to this feature, you would need to have a paid plan to use uh, on Brevo to actually use this feature. And so if you guys want to preview like how how an email would look um, if you sent it to one of your subscribers or your um, registered users on your Brevo account, then this would be the way to go. However, just to show you guys what I mean, so um, to actually access this, you would have to upgrade your plan but um, it's pretty much the same deal as sending a regular, a regular email. So let's uh, give our campaign a name. Basically just do the answer instructions. So let's just do um, a big sale and create a campaign. It's gonna take you through the same series of steps where you get to configure a sender, recipients, a subject, design, and so on and so forth. So yeah, there you guys have it. So hopefully this video will help you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. So if you guys want to show your support that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So with all of that said, thank you all for watching. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.